How you doing? It's uh, Brian and Sean again with Two A Guys in Gear, and today we're going to do like a quick review. Um, actually, it's a, a little before review on the um, Lenwood belts, the concealed carry belts. Yeah, so uh, we got hooked up with Lenwood leather, I guess formerly with Lenwood le leather, now they're just going by Lenwood, and uh, they sent us some belts, holsters, uh, Tydex wallets, things of that nature. Yeah, to try to, uh, out. Yeah, give them a test run for about a month or so, see how it goes, and uh, so that's what we kind of an unboxing here, if you will. So um, that belt, what belt is that? This is the hybrid belt, mm -hmm. um, leather. Right, and, um, and it actually has a PVC liner. Yeah. So, and that's the belt on their website that the guy's standing on. Right. So, and that's a, that's a hell of a belt. I've got one on now, actually. Oh, okay. And uh, it's it's insane. So yeah, it's pretty thick. If I had to say, it was. That thing's got to be a quarter, quarter inch, inch thick. thick. Yeah. yeah. So, and then um, and then on the other end of the spectrum, we have uh, this belt here. This is called their conveyor belt. So, and it's just what it says. It's it's a piece of conveyor belt that yeah, they turned into genius. a belt. I know it's it's really slick. I saw this on their website. I was like, I gotta have it. So, uh, so we'll give this a shot. See how it goes. See how we like that. And then um, also for holsters, I've got the uh, from SP101. I've got the uh, the Wraith holster. It's an outside the waistband holster, Tydex uh, retention holster, and it's uh, it's housing my Ruger SP101 right now. And Sean, you've got the um, IWB. Yep, inside the waistband, um, and yours is the Spectre. Spectre holster, yep. and uh, it's from a P64. So and then the one that I'm really curious about is the <laughs> uh, the the minimalist wallet. Right. So what do they call it? What's the tag say here? Um, the Wonderlust. The Wonderlust. Yeah, so it's a piece of Kydex and a piece of EPMD uh, rubber band, basically, to hold your money and your credit cards and things like that in. But I don't think it's going to work for me. I mean, here's my wallet now. I don't see how I'm going from, from one to another, you know? So yeah. we'll see. I don't know. For me, I think it's going to work great because I like carrying around just my ID card mm -hmm. and my credit card. Right. So, and I know you got the... I toolbox. carry everything I don't need. <laughs> I don't get that, but uh, um, yeah, there's. I don't know. Maybe he'll send you a bigger rubber band. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. I don't know. Get a bigger inner tube. <laughs> so we'll see. Yeah, so. I think it, I carry um, the uh, Spec Ops holster. I mean, um, Spec Ops wallet, mm -hmm. and this should fit inside it. Right. So now, when I don't need my wallet, I can just leave it, pull this out run with it right so that's why i think it's going to work for me but you i don't think it's going to work for but i don't think so i'm going to try it though i'll give yeah. it a fair shot we'll give so, it a run. um but yeah so we'll, we'll check back in in about a month after we've kind of given everything a good uh, run for its money yeah and, let uh, these break in and yep. uh, which i think that's going to be the key is letting these belts break in uh yeah. side note there with my belt i've got this on right now mm -hmm. and i've noticed after about three days it kind of stretched out just a shade just enough so it's just a little bit more comfortable mm -hmm. so oddly enough as stiff as that is it did stretch a little bit so which is good now have you so, tried that one on i have um i don't like this one as much as the uh uh, this one here but it's weren't nice. you saying you were having a little bit of trouble because of the the roughness yeah it's sliding through the belt loops? exactly yeah it's it's a uh, it's a heavily textured belt so and it's right. it's a conveyor belt so right. it's gonna be so um it's heavily textured so it is a little bit uh tougher to get through your belt loops yeah. than this is but it's not bad yeah so. but uh and you wore that one for a while didn't you yeah i wore this one for a couple weeks yeah. no problems so so we're gonna try these out and then um and we'll get back to you and let you know how everything worked all right, you'll stay tuned for the follow-up. Thanks. If you like us, please subscribe. See you.